hey cousins welcome back i just have a quick video for you guys today to make sure we're all caught up and up to date so if you haven't already please take this time to subscribe and i promise to give you all the juicy tidbits of the show that we know and love Ooh, and y'all wait till this new season comes up we really gonna get into the tea okay also i am currently revving up an instagram account for this channel that we can use to communicate in the between time and if you don't have an ig let me know in the comments because i can also put together a facebook and a twitter account too anyways i know i've been gone for a little second guys but mama needed a vacation <laughs> between working mothering wifing and youtubing i sure was tired by the way, if you all didn't know, I did post a vlog about the whole cruise experience, which was my first one, but y'all have to make sure y'all go watch them. They are extremely hilarious, sentimental, informative, and drama filled. All I'm gonna say is y'all will definitely see a different side to me that y'all fall in love with, no doubt, because my inner ball headedness has no sense. But yeah, it's six parts, so go watch. It's gonna be good. On to our main topic though. Guys, I'm afraid the rumors are true. Even though we still don't have a verbal confirmation, pictures, however, are worth a thousand words. And in this one, you see the original cast minus Quad taking pictures with two women. One who we know is Phaedra, of course. So they're basically saying it without saying it. Cause here's another picture. So all of you who were opposed, I'm sorry. And I offer my condolences. Many in the comment sections of these pictures expressed disgust, stating that they'd never watch the show again. And I've gotten mixed reviews on my channel too in the comments from you guys. As for myself, well, I'm partial. I don't really know Phaedra like that. I never got into the Real Housewives of Atlanta. So y'all would have to key me in on personality insights and let me know if y'all think she'd make a good fit. So, um, yeah, guys, with the rumors of her dating a doctor, it appears that along with some already existing relationships with some of the women of the Married to Medicine cast, it really was the only qualification she needed to be on the show. This honestly will be interesting. And I wonder if they'll actually show the man she's dating on the show, or if it'll be more like a Jasmine Johnson situation from Married to Medicine of LA. For those of you who are unfamiliar with that situation, she basically went the whole season without showing her husband once. He always seemed to be gone but she did have the biggest house on the show though <laughs> but anywho at this rate with quad and phaedra on the roster they should just change the show's name from married to medicine to associated with medicine because <laughs> what in the world is happening also in the picture is another physician by the name of dr alicia Gollum. she may be taking the place of dr contessa why i believe anila is being replaced by phaedra i just can't wait till they introduce dr alicia so we can see how somebody in the existing cast fakes a story about knowing her for a long time because <laughs> that's what's happened so many times in the past am i right anyways i hope she's ready she seems sweet but we all know looks can be deceiving but come what may i just hope she can stand on her own especially involving quad and dr heavenly <laughs> But y'all, this break between seasons has proven to be a crazy series of events. We had Mariah resurfacing after years of seclusion, the Phaedra rumors, Dr. Greg and his fiance joining the show, which I still think may be a possibility, and Dr. Contessa and Anila getting the boot. I don't know about y'all, but I cannot wait. Anywho, that concludes the main story. I do want to talk about one more thing before I go though. I recently took the advice of one of the cousins down in the comments section of another video. They told me to check out Love and Marriage of Huntsville, a Carlos King original, and y'all already know how I feel about him. <laughs> I'm almost done and caught up, but not just there yet. So far though, I would have to say it's not that polished and it's a mess. I will say that. That Melody and Martell Holt could have a whole show by themselves and we wouldn't even know the others existed. But y'all please let me know down below if y'all want me to start doing videos on that show. The one person recommending it is cool, but I need more than just one to start commentary. Anyways, that's all I have for this video. I hope you all enjoyed. Be sure to hit the like button and don't forget to subscribe. Also share if you care and go check out my personal vlog too about that cruise. Put it on while you're spring cleaning or picking greens. <laughs> I don't know just make sure you watch it but until next time bye